Hi guys, it's Matt here from Launch Helmet Cams. Last week we did a short tutorial on how to uh, make a contour chest mount um, from three different mounts uh, and that mount is now available on our website. If you go on and search for contour chest cam you'll find it on there uh, with a special bundle price. Uh, this week we're just going to give you some tips and pointers on how to get the most out of the contour chest mount. Um, the uh, chest mount that we made uh, utilizes the GoPro chest mount. Now um, this chest mount comes with what's called the J mount clip um, which is good for the GoPro because it helps get it off the uh, chest mount and allows you to rotate it but in the case of the contour camera it makes it stick out quite a long way so we've discovered that if you take this one off and put on the standard GoPro mount uh, you can get the camera a lot closer to the chest mount uh, which makes it a bit more stable um, and less likely to interfere uh, with what you're doing so you add the short amount here uh, and then the uh, Go, sorry, the GoPro uh, to uh, quarter inch tripod mount adapter. Let's just screws on like so, as per normal, and then uh, join the uh, contour universal mount onto the chest mount. Now we found that the uh, thread does just bottom out. Uh, when you've got it attached here, it will work as out of the box um, but just to make it a little bit more stable what we've done is we've removed the foam from here and then just added a washer um, just to make it that little bit more stable so we screw that up and have it placed all the way down the bottom of the slot again just to get the camera a little bit closer to the mount uh, to the chest mount <coughs> and then you slide on the camera So that gets the camera a lot closer uh, to the chest mount, makes it a bit more stable. Now the only other thing that we found um, is that as with all GoPro mounts there is a tiny little bit of shake uh, in this interface between the clip and the chest plate. Uh, the easiest way to get rid of that is use uh, the GoPro white rubber plug. Uh, you just place that in here, just get this out of the way, wedge it in place and that takes out all the shake from this mount just in here. Um, you can put this loop over the screw so that you don't lose it um, and there you're pretty much good to go. Now obviously if you don't have a GoPro camera you're not going to have these uh, clip and uh, the plug. Uh, the easiest way to get those is to purchase the GoPro grab bag that comes with the plug um, the shorter clip and as well as some other mounts uh, and attachments which you can use because you've got this uh, mount adapter here. Um, so we'll show you some examples uh, of some footage shot with this setup. Um, I had the camera probably set up a little bit too low so when you do yours you might want to set it up just a little bit higher. Um, also keep in mind this was shot with Contour GPS which has a 135 degree field of view uh, the newer Contour Roam and Contour Plus cameras have a wider field of view so you'll get a lot more in the shot. Uh, but yeah, check it out, see what you think.